What's good? Welcome back to the show. It's Speaker's Lab. The gang is back with Beaker and Lulu and Melly. What are you guys doing over there? Dude, we had so much fun yesterday. The bunnies were just running around for Easter like my whole family came over. Uh, I'll show you guys later. But right now, guys, I'm kind of in a bad mood. <laughs> there was some news in the news section of Clash today. Clash news! And we're gonna get into it in a second. We're not gonna get too deep into it because we also have to max the space. We're gonna do that in a second. But guys, get your shades on. Get your shoes off. There's a long-standing tradition in Clash of the higher level people in the clan giving obscenely powerful troops to the lower level people. I love it. And guys, Clash made a little change today where they announced a little change they're gonna make that is gonna sort of slow that down. And I'm bummed. Dude, it kind of reminds me of like when you get in an argument with your mom and you know she's right. Because like, I know Clash is right here. They're doing the right thing. Mom, I know you're right. I'm still gonna argue with you though. <laughs> love you, mom. Anyway, guys, let's jump into this in our brand new segment, Clash of Clans News. Man, now I feel like I should just text my mom and say like, I'm sorry for arguing with you all those times that you were probably right. <laughs> anyway, same with you, Clash. We love you. And I know you're trying to do the right thing here. You probably are doing the right thing because I was just thinking about this the other day. Yesterday, I was talking to one of my clanmates when I joined Unity Elite, my clan, 2013, the only requirement was level five wizards. Guys, nowadays, wizards are level 10. They go all the way up to level 10. So the game has changed so much in that time, troops have doubled in level. You can kind of see the problem, right? So basically, if you guys haven't seen this, this is all about setting a, a sort of a, a mild cap on the levels of troops that you could get. Like, if you're not max, you can't get max troops. Now, the cap is not very high. I think you can get max troops now, basically, you can basically get max troops at Tunnel 12 now, I think, right? I think level seven clan castle, because my clan castle is level nine. So, you know, we're talking like, once you get to Town Hall 12, I think you basically got access to everything. But where this is going to get kind of tricky is in the middle. You guys who were like Town Hall 6, 7, 8, 9 even. Guys, that's what I'm going to miss. And look, when you start a new base or when you have just a lower level base and you're cruising through, you know, those Town Halls, you can get max wizards or max balloons. Balloons are crazy at low levels because you get them from your Town Hall 12, Town Hall 15 climates, and they're max, and they just dunk on everybody. And I think that's the point, right? It's not very fair. It's not, it's not, <laughs> it is what it is, man. I'm just gonna miss it. Guys, I can think back to all the times recently when we've been on our other bases, we give ourselves, you know, max spells, sieges, troops, and it's so fun. And this is not gonna change that drastically unless, again, we're at lower, much lower levels, but I'm gonna miss it, dude. RIP. RIP to all the max troops who will no longer be max. I'm sorry, you deserve better. But seriously, Clash is probably doing the right thing here. Let us know what you guys think in the comments below. I mean, I get it. It's It feels so weird to have news from Clash that is not good news. Do you know what I mean? Like, when, when, when's the last time we got something from Clash that wasn't like something fun and new? This is neither. This is, this is the opposite of something new. It's like, <laughs> it's like we're taking away. And I think that's always tough in games whenever something gets taken away. Do you guys remember when they gave us 30 more seconds in raids? What? That was like, I, I feel like I dreamt that. I know I didn't, I know it was real, but dude, they gave us 30 more seconds in raids <laughs> and then they took it away, which I totally get. Oh, what do we got here guys? Okay, so we got a different army. Hi Pepe, how you doing? Uh, look, we, we're using a giant army again. I have not used giants in ages. It feels so old school, but I keep forgetting they go up to level 10 now. They're one of the few troops that goes to level 10. Like we were saying, wizards do, giants do. Doesn't Golem go up to level 10? It's just wild. Do you think the King and the Queen are ever gonna get to level 100? I kind of feel like no. So I, I feel like you could maybe make them better without just continually adding levels, right? Oh, come on, dude, don't die. No, 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 no. I hate when your healers die as soon as you drop them. It's just so, it just makes you, makes you feel terrible. <laughs> I'm sorry, healers. Anyway, should we try to bust in? We don't have the super wall maker, so if we do, we gotta be kind of careful. Wait, I can get through. Man, I love wall makers. <laughs> I kind of forget how good they are uh, until I use them. Normally I have super wall makers. Anyway, let's get a whiz over there. Perfect, perfect. Okay, I'm gonna check for trapos. Oh, so sneaky, dude, so sneaky. All right, we'll drop that, we'll drop that. Couple of giants, might as well. Let's get a Yeti over there. 
That's a single inferno. It's gonna kill me. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get a rage. Uh, King. What is happening over there? Guys, can we can we focus? Okay, great. Awesome. Let's go. So I'm gonna drop everybody in there and look at all these boulders, guys. I mean, this is wow. <laughs> a lot of boulders. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, hit a jump right there. Oh, you know what, dude? I brought wall breakers. I forgot to drop them. Yeah, it's cool. We had the jumps. It's cool. So I have a poison as well. I guess I didn't really hit it. I maybe I didn't need it. Let's hit the Oh, dude, look at that bowler crew. Why have we not used bowlers in so long? Like 15 bowlers is unstoppable. Well, I mean they can they can be stopped pretty easily, in fact. <laughs> if they hit if they hit traps, they can all die. But they're so fun. They're like the original super archer. You know, we love the super archer because they do that. You know, they can hit multiple buildings. Bowler can do that too. All right, I'm just gonna spam. Just zerg these uh Oh man. <laughs> Yo, this is so old school. Do you guys remember this? So people used to set up their base like this because wall breakers were so dumb back in the day. They would hit the, the point. Crazy, right? Like, I, I, I can't even imagine that being the case now. But the, over the years, they made wall breakers smarter a, a lot. They did it like quite often to the point where now they just bypass all that stuff. Pretty cool. Oh, this is good. This is good. This is good. Let's go. You know, guys, I think I usually do this slightly differently. I'm going to try to go in here with, uh, how about one giant, one yeti. I just want to try to keep everybody not shooting the queen. That's not obviously going very well, but uh, let's see what we can do here. Oh, perfect. That's what we wanted. All right, here we go. Hey, King, that's not what you're supposed to do. Go back, buddy. Go back. Oh, you're the worst. Anyway, we still love you. Okay, so are you good, Queen? Are you good? She's kind of good, dude. I think she's got this. Man, what a brave Queen. We love you. Anyway, guys, can we bust open that wall? We can. I did not think that would work. You know, usually you... Yeah, all right, cool. Oh, Queen, don't you die on me. Don't you die. All right, hit it, hit it. Yeah, buddy. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that was so sick. Just cruising through there with the with the quakes down. So fun. Guys, I wish I had hit the, the king ability already because we would have a ton of barbs around here. How about we do, let's get up a little bit more, then hit the, the king ability, get through that wall real quick, get that scatter shot taken down. See what I mean, guys? This was not a super high level base. I think that was the one thing that's gonna save us. But we get to the end here and we're able to just steamroll the heroes. Yeah, that's the thing though. The heroes were like half level of ours. So we definitely had an edge there. Cool. All right, guys, let's hit the pizza shield. Dunk. <laughs> guys, we did it. So what do you guys think? In the first one, we did the jumps. In the second one, we did the quakes. Do you guys think the quakes is better? I don't know. I mean, the quakes are kind of wasteful unless you do what we did here. You, you you knock a little bit of health off the town hall. I kind of like that. Is this Irish 09? Wait, I'm Beaker 09. Are we brothers? I didn't even make this name. Uh, my grandma nicknamed me Beaker. RIP. We love you, Graham. And my friend Adam made the name Beaker 09. I can't even remember. Like it was a screen name for something and it just stuck. Anyway, guys, we're back here today with the Hammer Jam event once again. And you guys know, we, we got a bit of loot. Wait, is that full? How does this always happen? Let's collect this and see how many walls we can do because it is time for the main event. All right, guys, welcome back to the main event, a show within a show where we do something stupid. You guys know what it is. Hey, are, is this all we have left? Stop it. 36 walls left, guys. 36. And we can do six today, right? You know what, man? It may not make any sense because it's spring and this is the Autumn Queen. But I'm going to use the Autumn Queen. Let's go. But guys, let me just say, somehow, some way, we're going to finish this. 
Let's do six more walls. In three, two, one. Unbelievable. Go right into the elixir. Dunk. Anyway, guys, we love you, and we will see you right here tomorrow on the one and only Beaker's Lab. Peace, guys.